Okay, um, I just wanted to kind of pontificate about uh, a few things here. So, the first thing um, that I want to mention, because nobody else on the planet will uh, bring this up, but um, the new drivers came out for in NVIDIA cards that allow you to use FreeSync monitors with um, uh, you know NVIDIA uh, you know GPUs, but fucking but what they're not telling you is that uh, NVIDIA is only supporting FreeSync over um, uh, you know DisplayPort, not HDMI. So even though Samsung has some, you know, just like normal televisions uh, that support FreeSync, they don't work with NVIDIA because they don't have DisplayPort inputs. They only have HDMI. So even though, it, yeah, they let you uh, use FreeSync, but, but effectively they cut off the, the displays, the TVs. And I know that this bullshit was intentional because... NVIDIA partnered with those companies to release those, uh, you know, BFG, uh, you know, displays, the 65-inch TVs that have G-Sync built into them, and those motherfuckers don't want you to be able to just get, you know, like an OLED uh, LG television and get variable refresh on it because they want you to have to buy their piece of shit BFG TVs. It's a fucking scam. So, so I just want you to be aware of that shit. You know, don't don't swallow that load of Nvidia dung that, that they're peddling. I mean, and also too, you know, just just as a general fuck you to Nvidia. Um, these motherfuckers just released a patch where, where somebody changed a zero to a one, and mysteriously their drivers can just work with FreeSync now. Fucking years go by, and they're leaving people who bought monitors out in the cold. You know, you know, even though the entire time those motherfuckers could have enabled it, they're, they're, they're really a bunch of pieces of shit. So, fuck you, NVIDIA. Fuck you for dragging your feet on uh, FreeSync. Fuck you for trying to block HDMI, even though there's no technical reason for it. You know, all in all, fuck you. Um, so, speaking of fuck you, uh, EVGA just came out with this new audio. Oh, God, even the name is dumb. New audio sound card. I'm not shooting you. 2019, and we're still releasing, uh, you know, discrete sound cards. What a fucking joke. And, um... This thing is 250 bucks. I'm not kidding. 250 bucks. Okay, okay. And, and let me just, even though this is going to sound like an onion article, this is actually an accurate description of the sound card. The sound card has uh, fucking RCA, uh, you, you know, uh, outputs, but it doesn't have HDMI. Yeah, 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 that's right. It doesn't have fucking HDMI, but you can plug your, uh, you know, red and, and white RCA cables that, you know, came from the Stone Age into them. Okay, now the next fucking doozy. It doesn't support surround sound, so it's only stereo. So, so, so let's review here. Um, no HDMI, uh, only stereo. It costs... $250, and it's sold by a company who releases GPUs that have HDMI audio built into them. I, I, I mean, I, I know you can't see it, but I'm looking around right now like, what the fuck is going on? Are, are we in some bizarro reality? Uh, so, and, and then just to, you know, top it off, I, I'm reading the forums, you know, I'm looking at people, you know, responding to... Uh, the, the news about this sound card and people are saying like oh this sounds interesting I, I ordered one just to check it out I mean it's just it, it just blows my mind I mean I mean you know that episode of The Simpsons where um, it talks about a new craze sweeping the nation throwing away food and it shows these clips of people just smiling at the camera and dumping food into trash cans and dumpsters that, that, that's basically what I'm seeing here only it's just with money um, it's just saying like, oh yeah, yeah, sure. Uh, you know, here let me just throw away two hundred fifty dollars on this piece of fucking crap that's worse than my built-in motherboard and graphics audio. What the fuck is this? So, um, yeah, so this is a big fuck you video. You know, fuck you EVGA, fuck you Nvidia, uh, yeah, fuck everything, fuck everyone. Um, God, this planet's dumb. So. Uh, to try to you know end this on a note of positivity, uh, as you can see with the Visual Studio uh, icon in the taskbar there, um, 
you know, work is progressing, things are going well. I've added some, you know, kind of cool stuff actually where there's some really nice, really nice, lovely, uh, complicated logic that I put in there for, um, uh, you know, destructible objects that drop items. So basically, um, it's going to work like this. Um, you know, characters have, um, you know, information set that basically says, you know, what is their weapon mastery? So Hagger's weapon mastery is that he can, you know, use the Molotov cocktail, he can use the sword, he can use the pipe, he can use knives. Uh, and, and, you know, Cody's uh, weapon mastery is something like, you know, he can uh, use knives and also stab as well as throw, and he can use a Molotov cocktail, blah, blah, blah. And then, you know, damned, his weapon mastery would be like, he can't use anything. Okay, so basically the way it works is, when you punch a drum can now, it says, all right, um, let's, let's check out the capabilities, the masteries of the character. And if somebody can use weapons, we'll roll the dice, and, and, and there might be a chance that the drum can will drop one of the weapons that he can use, or it can maybe drop uh, some health, uh, you know, a pack of gum, uh, chicken, you know, you, you know whatever the hell. Uh, so, so there's some really nice logic going on there, where depending on the character you are, depending on the character who destroys one of the destructible objects, it's going to dynamically drop random items. And so in the next photo album, um, you'll be able to go crazy with, uh, you know, the weapons in the game. Um, I, you know, I put a lot of work into those, and, and, and there's so, so many lovely mechanics, uh, you know, in there with the weapons that I hope people will appreciate. I mean, dumb people won't because they won't even be able to put two and two together, but, but there's really awesome shit you can do, like, just like the possibilities. Like, like, even if you're a character who can't use weapons, you can do really awesome stuff, like, like, if you beat the shit out of Sodom and he drops one of his swords on the ground, well, if you're damned, you can kick the sword, knock it up in the air, and then you can do the knockback move on the sword to actually launch the sword through the air and use it as a projectile to hit the other enemies. It's fucking great, man. So, that's awesome. Uh, EVGA and NVIDIA aren't awesome. Whatever.